So as a 17 year old girl, um, reinventing myself is kind of how I'm made. So one release theme for January um, is reinventing yourself. And I thought, okay, I'm a 17 year old girl. I'm a teenager. Who really gets reinventing yourself better than teenagers? I mean, that's really what we're about, you know? And I particularly am kind of obsessed with reinventing myself. You could say it's a low self-esteem thing, and I could agree with you. It's just what I've always done. Um, ever since I was really little, when I would get a new haircut, I wouldn't just get a trim, I would get a new hairstyle. And then once I got older, I'd get a new hair color. At the start of school, I wanted a new wardrobe. I wanted to try being someone else, or being a different version of myself. And now as I'm reaching that end of childhood and end of, um, end of teenagehood, almost, I don't know, I'm really realizing how much more I'm going to have to reinvent myself in the future and when I'm going to have to decide to stop and when to say, okay, I like this me, or I like this part of me, I'm keeping it. No matter what the world thinks or anything else, I'm keeping this. It's mine. So, you know, I'm starting to look at colleges, and I'm starting to look at what I'm going to do with the rest of my life. Um, I'm also starting to look at how I'm going to function as an adult, because while I'm not that cliche, spoiled, only child, I don't know how to do things. Yeah, that's gonna be a problem. But also, you know, I'm about to totally redo my hair, and that will come up shortly once I actually have money to do that. To me, it's not really a reinventing myself anymore because I don't like myself. It's a, I like who I am now, and this feels like a way that I'm expanding that person. Um, and it's just expressing myself, and I've always loved to. Um, you know, creative people express themselves, so that's why I write, that's why I read, that's why I sing, that's why I play instruments, that's why I decided to go to an art school, is because I'm creative and I want to express myself. That's why I'm doing these videos, is because what better way to express yourself than stand in front of a camera and do whatever the hell you want and see if other people like it. And if they don't, you change this camera persona. It doesn't mean you have to change yourself. It doesn't mean they exactly don't like you. It means that there is, you know, something not as entertaining as it could be. And to me, I know some people find that daunting, and I find it honestly a bit daunting, but to me, as as a person who wants to become an entertainer, who wants to become, you know, a professional anything, you know, a professional musician, writer, public role model to other kids like me, I think this is a great way to practice. Basically, I think that now that I'm getting older, everything I do is reinventing myself. I don't even have to do anything and I'm reinventing myself. I'm literally not the same person I was a year ago, two years ago. I'm just not. It's different cells, it's different, you know, body proportions, you know, whether I've lost weight, gained weight, grown an inch. That hasn't happened since sixth grade though. You know, I'm literally not the same person. I have new experiences, I have new friends, I have new things I care about. Care about. I have a lot of new things I care about. But it's just about being and becoming, I think. Um, so while it's a little bit, you know, like I said, daunting, and while it's a lot going on, and there's homework, and there's applications, and there's, oh, do I have enough credits? Oh, do I have enough volunteering hours? Oh, do I have enough, you know, extracurricular activities? Do I have enough? Do I have enough? Do I have enough? Do I have enough? It's kind of what my life has become these past couple of weeks, past couple of months. Do I have enough written for this essay? Do I have enough information and knowledge to pass this midterm? Have I practiced enough 
to get a good grade on my strings assessment. It's enough, 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 enough. And I'm also kind of learning, am I being enough for myself? Yeah, I'm doing all these things and I'm making all these expectations for other people. But am I meeting mine? One of my many New Year resolutions is to find out what I want to be and become it. And this is step one. So, this is the new me. This is a new year. Let's get started. Love you guys. Oh, and another thing that is a New Year's resolution is to stop procrastinating, which means I'm now going to do that homework I've put off all weekend to do.